concept. I'm doing my level two. What do I need to become an improver and how much can I make? I'm not 100% about those improver things, you know. But that's the thing. A lot of these guys here yeah, are doing these courses, yeah, where it's like these 16 week become electrician after 16 weeks and that, and then they're an improver. So many guys yeah, have hit me up on TikTok and that or Instagram and say, yo, can you check out this course? They'll give me a, a website link. I'll check out the website link. And, that, and it will say something along the lines that you'll become an improver once you've got your qualification or once you've passed the course. But like, let me tell you something right now. Yeah. All of these um, electrical firms, let's let's use some London local ones and that Purdy, Old Cray, whoever in it. None of them are asking for improver electricians. They want fully qualified electricians. If you have your electrics tripping out and you ain't got no rust cut electrics in your yard and you know it's got nothing to do with the national grid and the RCD is tripping in your yard. If you phone up two electricians and one says he's an improver and one says he's a qualified electrician, who the fuck are you going to call? You, you want the guy who's a fully qualified electrician, not some improver. So you don't need to stop trying to um, do these 16 week courses to become an improver and uh, do the full course, which is minimum of two years. Well, at least if you're going to do the 16 week course or whatever, however short term it is and that, you don't want to be known as an improver. Eh? Stop trying to skip and, and cut corners.